in the greater scheme of things, 450 deaths might seem tiny because we didn't lose them in the numbers that we've lost in the Great Wars. So people would question, you know, are the sacrifices that great? One death in combat is a huge sacrifice to the family that lost their loved one. I've missed out on being a grandmother. I've missed out on seeing my son get married. All the hopes and the aspirations that you have for your children are just snuffed out in a moment. William, um, oh God, I can't do this. Uh, William was my firstborn son, my eldest son. Um, in fact, he would have celebrated his 30th birthday on Sunday. William was on an early morning patrol um, with members of his platoon. There was a daisy chain of IEDs that essentially killed five members of his platoon, injured five more very seriously. It was the incident that was the catalyst, I think, that woke the UK up to what was actually happening in Afghanistan. Within a matter of 24 hours, eight service personnel, including the five that had been killed from Williams Battalion, had been killed. We have to live with our losses for the rest of our lives. You know, when, when all the flag waving has gone away, when all the Remembrance Sundays fade into obscurity for a lot of people, they're still happening for us until the day we draw our last breath. A lot of families will breathe a sigh of relief that their troops, you know, the troops are coming home. Um, they're not, there aren't going to be any more deaths, but I think the most devastating thing for me was just feeling like I'd been lied to. I felt my son had been lied to. Lied to in what sense? There didn't seem to be a clear objective. There didn't seem to be an exit strategy. The only lasting hope that I can have is in the youth of Afghanistan, that they have a deeper understanding themselves of what the sacrifices are. They've lost so many themselves. They've lost so many innocent people as well over there. I'd like to see with my eyes, what did we achieve? What was the sacrifice for? Because it's too high a price to pay. If it was for nothing. Do you think it was for nothing? At the moment, until someone can show me otherwise, yeah.